Civil Engineering Academy. Hello there, engineers. Welcome to Civil Engineering Academy. Today we're looking at a problem from probability and statistics. It reads like this. A study gives the following results for a total sample size of eight. The sample, each individual sample, is 2, 3, 5, 8, 8, 10, 10, 12. The mean of the sample is 7.25. What is most nearly the standard deviation? Well, the standard deviation is a measurement of how spread out a sample of uh, number is, uh, numbers are. Um, and if we look on page 37 of your FE reference handbook, you're going to find this equation, which is the sample standard deviation equation. And it says that uh, the standard deviation is 1 over the number of samples minus 1 times the summation of each individual sample value minus the sample mean squared. And all of that, take the square root. So uh, we know that our n equals 8, that's a given, and we know our x bar, or our sample mean, equals 7.25. So we have all the things we need to, to figure out the answer to this. Um, let's create a big radical sign here because we've got a lot of terms to fit under it. And we're going to start with the first term. So we've got 1 over the number of samples minus 1 all times each individual sample number so we're going to start with 2 minus the sample mean 7.25 squared plus the next term which we know is 3 minus the sample mean squared plus the next term 5 minus again the sample mean squared plus the next term is 8 minus 7.25 squared plus and you kinda get the idea of the pattern there so I'm gonna put a dot 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 until we get to the last term, 12 minus the sample mean squared. And all this is within the brackets. So let's consolidate all this. If we do that, <clears throat> we're going to have S equals the square root of 1 over 7 times, if we consolidate all these terms, we get 89.5. Continuing on, put that in your calculator. You should get a value that approximates 3.57, which is most nearly 3.7. So our answer is D. Hope that helps you out with uh, standard deviations. See you on the next one. Thanks.